Kodanatamana is situated in Vellarakada near Kunnugulam, Trishu district. The land has many interesting stories. Kodanatamana is said to have been built under the aegis of the king of Cochin as a gift to a Brahmin family. The mana is located centrally in 3.5 acres of land. Pumukam or the Fazad has a speciality. While most of the old constructions have open Pumukams, in Kodanatumana it is closed. As one of the traditional art forms, Chakyar Kutha used to be performed here. So the Pumukam of the Mana is known as the Puratala. The family is said to be of the lineage of Aknihotri a famous saint of Valvanada. Though in reality Agnihotri belongs to Merathur, his family line stemmed from one of his wives Pushpini. The actual construction of the hundred year old mana was done by Velaniri Nambudri, who has also built the famed Pumuli mana, a Padnaragata structure and Kurur Mana, etc. The construction was completed with the help of Kunyuni Nambudri of Tripuritara Palace. The wood used for the construction of this Mana, mostly teak and irul, were brought from the Machad Hills near Vadakanjeri. Those days, Paddy was given a salary to the workers who did the woodwork. The mana boasts of royal inhabitants. Lalan Tampuran of Tripunitara Palace had his maternal lineage to Kodanatu Mana and he used to visit the place in a pallak or chariot. The chariot that he gifted to the mana can be still seen here. Even in those earlier times, the members of this mana were well educated. One Mr. Maheshwaran Nambudri, who studied in England, had brought back a locker for the mana. The rare and antique piece is still kept safe and intact. Compared to few family members, they had about 18 or more caretakers in this mana. Kodanatu mana is an etiquette structure where Eight halls are joined together with a central courtyard open to the sky. Nadumuttam in the mana holds an idol of Lord Ayappa. The rooms and corridors of the mana 
showcase the opulence and memoirs of the past golden days. The complex has more than 20 rooms, two kitchens, two storerooms, two ponds and three wells. The roof of the mana is built in a special architectural style called the Vatasri Kovil. This style of construction is mainly used in the construction of temples. Nowadays no one can build or reconstruct the work as it requires a challenging mind and lots of hard work. In 1965 the partition of the mana was done and Mr. Kodanata Narayanan Nambudri Padar got the ownership of this mana. His son, Professor Maheshwaran Nambudri's family is living here for the last 40 years. Batra Andarjanam, wife of Maheshwaran Nambudri, is a present custodian of this mana. She has kept the place in good condition for the future generation to wonder about the golden days of the traditional Nambodri homesteads. For more such interesting features, do keep watching webindia123.com.